We're trying to create a centre of excellence here for helping patients to fare better with their chronic and debilitating headaches. So patients come to the specialist headache clinic if their headaches are very persistent, not responding to um, treatment within our regular clinic, um, or if their headaches are perhaps not neck driven, but they're actually say chronic migraine and they are wondering whether any further input could be helpful. And so a lot of what we do isn't just about technique, it's about patient education. The main benefits of an osteopathic approach to helping with headaches and helping people manage their headaches is that we can offer help on two fronts, obviously reducing the, the physical tensions that play into the headache cascade, but also we look at the people's lifestyles and their occupational stresses and strains and their nutritional and relaxation status and so forth. So typically when a patient first comes to the ESO headache clinic, they can expect to be listened to fully and they'll then have a lot of questions, not only about their headaches, but also about their general health because we want to make sure that it's safe to treat them. The problem out there is that um, at least half of, uh, for example, migraines are self-diagnosed and the other half, sadly, are often misdiagnosed. This has been shown by population studies. And it means that we do need to sift through everything one more time to make sure that we have a correct diagnosis and to double check that. And so once we've listened to them describe their headaches, often they have more than one kind as well, so it can be quite complicated. Um, we take a look at them physically, so we typically do an examination in sort of uh, light, loose clothing um, to see what what might be contributing to the, um, the headache condition structurally. And we also do, particularly in the case of migraine, um, which is much more than a headache, we do a lot of patient education because uh, we can base it on the evidence out there of what, what is likely to help them um, based on their own observations of their headaches. So it's very much a team approach um, with the, the students, the patients, the doctors and ourselves, and sometimes other practitioners as well. So on the first occasion, the patient may get a fairly short treatment just to um, see how sensitive they are to treatment and all being well, uh, then we would tend to do um, what is recommended between four to six treatments. Um, sometimes there are some quite long-standing tensions that need to be released. Um, and then we, we work with them as we go along and adjust the, um, the techniques we use accordingly. But they're all very safe, very gentle and uh, very much with ongoing consent from the patient so people actually enjoy their sessions. I work in a teaching environment because it, it gives me the chance to um, refresh my knowledge. I have to be up to date and up to speed for the students who are now graduating. Um, it also gives me the chance to connect with colleagues who are likewise in a lively collegiate environment and I think it's very healthy. This is the first uh, student headache clinic in an osteopathy school, so I'm tremendously proud of that. I'm proud of the medical support that I've had in the background um, from neurologists and headache specialists, and we're beginning to get known amongst the GPs locally, uh, and also the results. You know, people are getting better which is great. Even if it's just a part of the solution, um, feeling that people are able to be more comfortable or more productive um, is very exciting. And to feel that that's been done just using uh, your, your ears, your analytical skills, and a good pair of hands is really satisfying. It's natural, isn't it?